Hello everyone and welcome to Machine Learning and AI Tutorials. In this AI tutorial, we explain how to install the newest OpenAI model called GPT OSS 20B on a Linux Ubuntu computer. First, let's provide some background information about this model. Namely, recently OpenAI released two models. The first model is GPT OSS 120B and the second model is GPT OSS 20B. This second model, that is the GPT OSS 20B, requires only a GPU with 16GB of RAM and it can be executed locally. That is, this is an open source model released under the Apache license. Another interesting thing about this model is that it can be used to develop agents and it can be used for various tasks such as, for example, solving mathematic problems, such as, for example, providing engineering solutions, etc. And finally, it's released under the Apache 2.0 license, which is a very permissive license. In this video tutorial, we explain how to install this model by using the Olama framework. For those of you who are new to Olama, Olama is arguably one of the simplest methods, or better to say frameworks, to run large language models on local computers. You simply download Olama, and you download the model, and you can even run the model in a nice graphics user interface. Okay, so let's start with installation. The first step is to install Olama. For that purpose, you need to go to the Olama website that is you need to go over here and then over here you need to click on download you need to select your operating system and this command will be generated however don't immediately copy this command and execute in your terminal since you need to do several things before okay so now what I will do I will close my terminal and I'm going to open a new terminal here it is and inside of this new terminal, I first need to do several things. I need to ex execute these commands. The first two commands that I need to execute will update and upgrade all the packages on my system. Consequently, type sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade. And this will update and upgrade all the packages, such as that everything is up to date and such that we can install everything correctly. Okay, press Y over here and be patient until your system is being updated and upgraded. Next, we need to install curl such that we can download and install all Llama. We can do it by executing this command. And finally, let's verify that curl is properly installed. To do that, let's type this and you should see this generic reply. Next, let's allow this internal port such that we can run Olama from our browser and note over here that we are running on our local computer that is you're not opening the port to other external entities okay so let's continue now let's go back to the Olama website and now we can use curl and sh to install everything so copy this command and paste it over here and this should install Olama on your local Linux Ubuntu computer you can see where uh, everything is being installed. Previously, I had the previous version of Olama and this is being uh, cleaned up, which is a nice thing. And now Olama is being downloaded, good. To make sure that Olama is running, simply type Olama and you should see this generic response. Next, uh, you can type Olama list to list all the models. Of course, there's nothing since we didn't download the model. And the final step, you can go to your web browser and you can type something like this. You can do localhost and you can enter 11434 and then if you press enter, you should see this message Olama is running. The next step is to download the model. Okay, so to download the model, go back to the Olama website and then over here, search for GPT OSS and here is the model. Then I'm going to download this model. So click here and copy this command. Then your terminal simply paste this command. So I will type this, 
However, modify run and instead of run type pool. This will simply download the model without running it. And now the model will be downloaded. It's going to take around two or three minutes to download the model in my case. However, in your case, if you have a faster or slower connections, the download speed and the download time might be different. Okay, so let's be patient and let's wait. And after the model is downloaded, you should see this message writing manifest and you can see success over here. So let's learn how to run the model. First of all, type Olama list to make sure that the model is there. Here it is. And then to run the model, you can simply copy this and then we can type Olama run. And then let's over here paste the model name and this should load the model in your computer memory and you will be able to run the model. And let's ask the question, who are you? And let's see the response. Here's how the model responds. Uh, now over here, I'm using NVIDIA uh, 39 with 24 gigabyte of VRAM and you can see how the models, how the model responds. And let's ask the question, how to solve a quadratic equation, for example, something like this just as a brief test and you can see how quickly the result is being generated and you can see even the latex formulation so you can include the result in your document there is an approach to run this model by using graphics user interface and i will cover this in my future video tutorials to exit you can simply press ctrl d and you are out and let me show you another trick let's say you want to erase this model since this model occupies around 13 gigabytes you will simply type olama rm and then you will specify the model name so let's copy this and let's paste this and let's erase the model like this and now the model is being erased okay that's all for today and thanks for watching and after the model is downloaded, you should see this message writing manifest and you can see success over here. So let's learn how to run the model. First of all, type Olama list to make sure that the model is there. Here it is. And then to run the model, you can simply copy this and then we can type Olama run. And then let's over here paste the model name and this should load the model in your computer memory and you will be able to run the model. And let's ask the question, who are you? And let's see the response. Here's how the model responds. Uh, now over here, I'm using NVIDIA uh, 39 with 24 gigabyte of VRAM and you can see how the models, how the model responds. And let's ask the question, how to solve a quadratic equation, for example, something like this just as a brief test and you can see how quickly the result is being generated and you can see even the latex formulation so you can include the result in your document there is an approach to run this model by using graphics user interface and i will cover this in my future video tutorials to exit you can simply press ctrl d and you are out and let me show you another trick. Let's say you want to erase this model since this model occupies around 13 gigabytes. You will simply type Olama RM and then you will specify the model name. So let's copy this and let's paste this and let's erase the model like this. And now the model is being erased. Okay, that's all for today and thanks for watching.